Bonjour YouTube, I hope you guys are having a great day. It is currently 1.47 here. Uh, I did wake up earlier, I just didn't start the vlog in the morning today. Um, I got gardeners going on next door. I definitely am just having one of those days I just had trouble getting up. I'm not sleeping well guys, I'm literally not sleeping well. And it really, really sucks. I woke up about four times in the night. One time's bad enough. One time may not affect you as bad, but four times, it's, man, it gets to you. I had some weird dreams. McGregor was barking throughout the night. I had to go out to go potty a couple times. It was bad. It was bad last night. And it's making me nuts because I need my sleep. Everybody needs sleep and they need a good night's sleep. So what's going on right now is I'm going to take McGregor, uh, see if uh, the uh, pet place close to my house has some room to take him in to give him a bath. Come on, buddy. He does this. He likes to stand in the middle of the door, especially when somebody wants to shut it. Um, I forgot to lock my door. Um, Cause he needs a bath and he also needs his nails clipped. I'm just gonna go see if they're open. Also, I'm gonna drop all that stuff off at Goodwill. I've got a migraine headache. It ain't going so well. Um, I'm gonna try and hopefully get that room tour done today. Yesterday, I wasn't feeling well. Um, my stomach was very, very upset yesterday with me. Um, so that wasn't good at all, like it was bad yesterday. Um, so obviously there's no footage from yesterday. I didn't keep it, I deleted it. I didn't I didn't feel like putting it up. I didn't want to put it up. There wasn't enough footage or there was too much, there was too much footage anyways. Um, and I just, I really didn't feel like putting up yesterday's vlog guys. So I deleted the footage from yesterday in all honesty. Um, it's nice that I've got some oranges coming in though. Look at all of them coming in now. Look at all of them. They're starting to turn yellow. Starting to get into their orange phase. Uh, so yeah, so I'm off to do those two things I said and uh, see you guys in a bit. Hello YouTube. Uh, bonjour, I mean. I'm trying to stick to saying bonjour. Bonjour. Um, that was weird. That was weird, Tristan. Uh, McGregor didn't go get a bath. They closed early today because I guess that they were, they just had a really slow day. The owner already told them to uh, close down. I did. I was able to walk in and talk to somebody, so hopefully I can get him in tomorrow. The thing is, I have Cardi from three to three thirty, so I'm gonna try and call him early and see if they can be done before three or by three thirty kind of thing. That way I can pick him up on the way back from karate. Um, so I'll call them in the morning and talk to them. Speaking of that, hopefully I still have their business card. I grabbed one of their business cards and I have no idea where I put it. I hope I didn't lose it, which I might have. I don't see it. Uh oh, I think I might have lost their business card. <laughs> Good job, Tristan. Good job. I'm legit trying to look for the business card because I know I grabbed one. Oh, there it is. Okay. Oof. Scared myself there for a moment. I do have their business card. Okay. I slipped it in my wallet. Um. So anyways, for the time being, the vampire has got to go away right now. And I'm trying to... Okay, that's not going to work apparently. It doesn't need to go all the way up. There we go. Ah, the sun. You know, because of the time change, the sun kind of comes in through my window kind of early, guys. That's why I'm trying to wake up and uh, try and, with the room tour, I'm trying to get up so that way the sun isn't exactly blowing through completely where it's blinding. But, um, you know, that way I can get my room tour done, but then that way it's also natural lighting. Because otherwise you guys can't really see my room that well at night. Uh, through the camera at least because the lighting's so bad. I still probably will try to do it. You guys might just be slightly blinded um, Or I'll keep the blinds open and just put the curtain there um, But there's a couple things I want to do first 
uh, with my wall shelves. I want to put that one over there and put those a little higher um, and then put my square ones, which I don't think they're black. I think they're espresso, but they were like cheaper than the black ones. I think like by $10. Uh, so I just, I, I decided to get the espresso one, so they might not match my room. But I like to put those there. So, yeah, as you guys can see, it's super bright. I don't know if you guys can actually see that. My hand's like a vampire. Because I'm so white. Um, yeah, I went and took all that stuff to the thrift store. And, um, I got my dad some gas. His car was empty. I don't know why, my dad has this thing of wanting to run out of gas. Or something, you know, like he waits till last minute. If you guys watch Ty Moss, he used to do that. I don't know if he still does. It's not that you mean to do it. And I don't know if Ty Moss's car had a gas light or not. But it's not like you mean to do it. You just get so low and some old cars don't warn you as well. Uh, like they do in modern uh, days. Like last couple of year cars where they actually ding or something. Uh, you know, actually legit warn you that you're low on gas. Uh, so with my dad's van, I don't think it does it. I think only a gas symbol might come up. Um, so I, I went, I mean, he wasn't real low, like almost, he was close to being empty, but his gas light wasn't on, but it was still, it still looked like empty. So, you know, like he was real close to it. So I went and got him gas. Um, anyways, I filled up his car because that's what kind of son I am. I'm a great son. Uh, and all I did was literally go down the street, uh, that way to see the, uh, peg grooming place if they could take them and then I came back up and went down that way for the thrift store because thrift store is literally a minute away from me so is the pet groomers they're just opposite uh two different if you guys know what I mean uh, so yeah so right now I'm going to try and do those wall shelves to get things going uh finish cleaning my room and then do the room tour yes I'm cleaning it number one because I am doing the room tour but number two my room really needed to be dusted I mean, look at this bed frame with the lighting. If you guys can see it, if it lights you. It's really dusty. And I forget how dusty my, my furniture can get in here, especially with dogs. It's constantly needing to be cleaned. Um, so that's what I did, uh, is try and dust. Especially since I've got black furniture as well. Black furniture is the worst of collecting dust. You guys would be surprised um, if you guys don't clean your own rooms like dust. Ask your parents. You guys would be surprised how much dust will cl will collect on your furniture and everything. Your parents, most likely, they do go in your room and they do dust things off. If it's not a parent, it's probably like a housekeeper or maid if you have one of those. Um, and, uh, yeah. So you guys would be surprised. That's usually how parents find things. So if you got something to hide from your parents, first of all, don't. Don't hide it. But, uh, not that I control you. If you do... That's your own room. Clean it. Legit clean it. You know, that way your parents don't have to go snooping. Um, you know, and keep up with cleaning it too. That way your parents are like, hmm, something's up with him or her. Uh, so yeah, okay, so I'm going to get some things done. I'll see you guys in a bit. So I got super, super annoyed with my wall shelf. And when it go up, sun's going down, kind of. Um, first off, I made it way too uneven. That was the first hole and second hole are almost in the same area. There's a giant bubble there now. Uh, and then I made it way too low. And then I accidentally went a little sideways. From that one there, I went a little sideways, so then it was off. So I got really annoyed with that wall shelf, so I'll try to work on it later. I'm going to try and do my square ones right now. It's so hard sometimes to make those even. They're either nice to you or they're not. It just, it's really a pain, <laughs> to be honest with you guys, it's just, it's a pain. Um, so I'm going to try and work on my square ones. Again, I didn't forget about the room tour. It's not going to happen tonight. I need to get up in the morning and do it. Uh, tomorrow morning I got to call and try and maybe take McGregor in. Um, and Russ is being a, actually a very bad boy right now. So I'm going to throw his eagle at him here. Ross, stop that. <laughs> I landed on him. Um, I also have to call in and renew my medication here, which I'm trying to cover up my last name, by the way. That's why I'm holding it like this. But uh, that way you guys don't see my full last name, at least. Um, so 
So I've got renewed this medication and yeah, I'm just going to try and get a couple things done. Uh, that way I can definitely do the room tour by tomorrow. Also, just so you guys know, I still plan to get a couple things. I've said this before, my room is not done. Um, I'd like to get a double uh, black laundry basket, which they're like sewed together. Or I might, I could get two separately, but it's just cheaper to get the doubles instead of trying to get two. That way I can have lights and darks. And then keep these ones for sports. They're nice, but they easily tip over. Um, you can have clothes to one side. Let's see if it'll do it. You have clothes to one side kind of like that, but it's tipped over. It's like leaning one way. I'm trying to show you guys maybe a better way. So, kind of like that. You guys can see it's tipped over that way now. So that's the problem with these is that you kind of got to kind of keep them even in order for them to stand up like that. Um, I did finish my closet though. Uh, you guys will see this room tour as well. My shirts are hanging. I've got all my pants up on pant hangers. Uh, this one looks like it's a little stuck behind that one. Um, of course, there's pants missing because I'm wearing them right now. Cargo jogger pants. These jogger pants are very comfortable and so easy to be able to put on. I know some jogger pants you can put a belt on. You just got to find those ones. Uh, but I love these pants. They're so comfortable, so easy to put on. And also, if you gain a little weight, they can be stretchy. Or if you lose a little weight, you just tie it. And that's what I love about these. That way you don't have to deal with them with the buttons. Because uh, lately, uh, I've been getting a little bit bolder and broader because I'm trying to work out a lot more. And so my pants have stopped fitting me with the buttons. So I actually need to try those on and see if any still fit me or if I need to just give them away and slowly try and uh, accumulate some more pants in a bigger size. Uh, so I do need to try out my pants. I do know, I already know some don't fit me and I've put them to the side somewhere. Also that pair is missing a button. So I was going to throw the button on that pair and try them on as well. I believe actually those pants are too tight for me. Those ones right there. That's why they're hanging there but I always forget that I want to put a button on. Um, actually it's not easy for me to sew. I'm not a sewer either so I'll probably have to take those in. Um, also I need to take my uniform in to get something to sew or maybe I'll ask my stepmom if she can do it. Uh, sew my two stars on my uniform. And yeah, Lily's been chilling with us today. Hey, Lily. Hey, Lily. And my phone's going off. So, yeah, I'm just going to try and take it easy for the rest of the day today. To be honest with you guys, I don't think I'll be doing too much filming. Maybe I'll show you guys after I put my square things up how they look. Uh, maybe. I don't know. Maybe I'll save that actually for the room tour. That's probably what I'll do. I'm trying to do the room tour tomorrow. I'm all also going to get an Alex uh, cabinet or drawer unit uh, from Ikea, which I'm going to end up putting right there and maybe putting my laundry basket right next to it. Benches inside there for now. I don't sit on it too much because I've got my desk in here and I've got that chair. So it looks, it, it's fine in there. Eventually I might, uh, if I can make this room bigger ever, I might eventually put have a space made for it if I can build my room back that way but that would only happen if I buy this house and if I decide to buy this house which I'm still considering because I think I would like to have a three bedroom because a two bedroom is nice but I like a three bedroom um, or at least a bigger bedroom that way I can fit my office better a little office like this better in my room um, and then have a spare bedroom or three bedroom that way I can actually get up out of bed and go into an office and work in there most of the day to come back in my bedroom and keep them separately. Um, but for the meantime, I am stuck with this house. And yeah, uh, um, I do still plan on getting carpet cleaner and stuff because if I move, then definitely need to finish painting the walls and I eventually probably would have to paint this wall white because uh, that's what people like. I only painted blue because that's my favorite color. Um, of course, and get some new light fixtures and whatnot for like this kind of stuff. But, you know, just plain white ones and just fix up this house a little bit. And uh, yeah, but I really love this area where I live right now. Everybody's so nice and friendly, and we're so protective of of, uh, of each other. Yeah, so I'm gonna get to work. I hope you guys are having a great day. 
Um, I think it's close to about 4 p.m. And um, we'll check. Because why not? Dogs, by the way, have not been peeing in the house. They've been very good about that. It's 4 10 p.m. So, yeah, it's close to 4. Uh, or actually, it's 4 10, so it's past 4. But you guys know what I meant. Uh, I said it's close to 4, so it's pretty, pretty accurate guessing the time of day. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna get some things done. I'm also gonna vacuum all the hair. There's like a bunch of hair and dust from the dogs in there. There's also glass way down there. I need to try and figure how to get that out because, yeah. Yeah. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care.